Trigger warning. This is a pro-femme channel that promotes the liberation of Black, Brown, LGBTQIA+, and other marginalized folks. We will speak on social issues that will make some people uncomfortable. This space may not be for everyone because of that, and that is okay. It is highly encouraged to do your own research, check your bias, and form your own opinions. Please be respectful when commenting or sharing your opinions, as hateful, bigoted, misinformed rhetoric will not be tolerated. Discussions of race, gender, and identity lie ahead. Please do not watch if social construct topics offend you. All right, so here we are back at it again um, for the best of 2023 movies edition. So best and worst, I should say. For S tier, we have this giving everything. A tier is purr with a little nail emoji. C or B, I don't remember, um, is mid, is what we called it. And then D tier is on confusion. And then F tier is you tried it, but absolutely not. <laughs> okay. Leave the world behind. This the one that um, the Obamas had a little hand in. If y'all didn't know that, now you know. Um, It was giving QAnon. It was giving MAGA. There was a Karen in this, played by Julia Roberts, of all people. This was my first time experiencing Julia Roberts as an actress. I did not like it, and now I'm looking at her sideways. I'm not going to lie, because she played her role a little too well. <laughs> she played it a little too well, I'm not going to lie. It makes me think, like, mm, you got some of that deep down in there? I don't know. My spirit was disturbed on this one, <laughs> okay? The ancestors was disturbed, everything. I could not stand how the daughter, the Black daughter, was left to, like, basically fit for herself with somebody who did not respect her, did not care for her as a human being. Her daddy was foul um, for not, like, protecting her, basically. I'm like, really? Why are we depicting this? I'm like, as the Obamas being involved in this, you know, y'all know better than to do something like this. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know that may be rude, child. <laughs> I just have to say how I feel about that. Like, I'm like, why would you write something like this? You know, the, the black daddy more concerned about the other kids and his own kid. I'm like, what is wrong with you? And then trying to get with, look, I'm spoiling the whole thing. I'm sorry. Spoiler alert. I have to on this one in order to get my full opinion. Okay. Um, you want to sleep with the person that's mistreating your child because she's fetishizing you? Like, you're disgusting. I'm sorry. I have to say, you're disgusting. I was triggered <laughs> the entire movie. Triggered and upset for that girl. So you tried it, but absolutely not. I was going to put it in um, confusion because a whole bunch of people were like, oh, yeah, this is a good movie. It's a good movie. And it was top one on Netflix for like two days. And I was like, what is wrong with people? Uh, <laughs> I'm so sorry. Clearly, I'm very passionate about this. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm so passionate about it. I'm so mad. I will stay mad about that movie. <laughs> I just feel like, what in the world? What came over them? That's what I want to know. What in the world would possess them to make a movie like that? <laughs> Okay, I was just like, absolutely not. Kevin Bacon is in this. He's giving MAGA. Like, what the fuck? Child, mm-mm. 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 And it's like apocalyptic, basically. Child, mm -mm. And them ignoring the little girl. I'm glad what happened happened at the end. Because they was ignoring that little girl for no reason. Child. I was, look, you can ask my friend that I watched this with. I was irate the entire movie. I was on edge. I was pissed off the entire movie. <laughs> I was. I was. And we both choked when we saw that the Obamas were in the credits. Okay. Moving on. Because I need to get out of this energy hair flip. <laughs> Let me hair flip this off. I feel like Whitney <laughs> from Salt Lake City. Real husband of Salt Lake City. What is this again? <laughs> we're going to cleanse the, our auras. <laughs> That's how I feel right now. <laughs> okay. Oh, 
Child, let me let me woo side for a second. Hold up, hold up. Woo Okay. Okay, so that's that on that, honey. Um if you want more content like this, check out the Patreon or whatever. We do full reviews over there. Um, uh, you know, we talk about albums, we do tarot readings, pop culture tarot readings, collective readings. Um, yeah, we kind of just do anything to like relax and unwind over there. So check it out. Okay, that's a just the link in description. <laughs> okay. And yeah, so thank y'all so much for being here. Hope you enjoy the rest of your life. Thanks, bye. <laughs> and thanks for helping us get over a hundred subscribers by the end of the year. That was awesome. Thank you, thank you, y'all. Thank you, thank you. Okay, if y'all want to make some requests on topics like reasonable, because I'm not gonna talk about things that will trigger me. <laughs> I have to say, or be super trauma, like trauma inducing. I'm not doing that. Um, but you know, just make make some requests. I'll decide that on my own. You know what I'm saying? But make some requests or whatever in the comments, okay? Let me know your thoughts on this and everything. So that's that on that chat. <laughs> so thanks so much for being here. Hope you enjoyed the Okay, thanks. Bye.